to do something with my life. I'm going to get off this couch. Comedy. Burlesque. Strong. What's going on? I'm Johnny Barocious, finest manager in all of the Northeast. Woo! <laughs> Guys like the coat? Yes! Hey, guess what I'm selling? Bingo. I'm selling me. a phone book, he's going to do fucking something to this phone book. Before he's going to do that, Mr. Sullivan, I heard that you, you need to uh, warm up before you do the thing to the, to the fucking phone book. Is that true? You heard him? Mr. Sullivan, in what fashion do you need to warm up by? Okay. Well, ladies, uh, I'll leave you to Mr. Sullivan. Mr. Sullivan, please warm up before you uh, demonstrate your act of strength of the phone book. What's he going to do? Ladies and gentlemen, what is happening? Whoa!
What the hell is going on? Mr. Sullivan, thank you. But before we perform this act of strength, ladies and gentlemen, I need a volunteer from the audience. Oh, right here. Here's a, uh, a random, unknown volunteer who I've never met before. Can we have a nice, warm, Inman Square welcome for our random, unknown volunteer from the audience, please. <laughs> Young lady, can you please tell these kind ladies and gentlemen, what is your name? My name is Annabelle. Thank you. Not a person that I've never met before. Thank you, Annabelle. My name's Johnny. Very nice to meet you, Annabelle. Annabelle, what city or town do you live in? Cambridge. All right, Annabelle from Inman Square in Cambridge. Annabelle, what is your phone number? Uh, okay, not now. I'll ask you after the show. Check out the bathroom wall. <laughs> I thought her name sounded familiar. Annabelle, would you please inspect this phone book and tell me if this is a real phone book? Uh, okay, a random volunteer from the audience. Thank you very much. Let's hear it for Annabelle one more time, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Mr. Sullivan, I present you a phone book to demonstrate your strength and how secure this audience is tonight. Thank you, Mr. Sullivan. Ladies and gentlemen, I never really got along all that well with my dad, but it has gotten a lot better. I think it all turned around when he finally did the one thing I always wanted him to do. He said he's proud of me. I'm kidding, he died! Ladies and gentlemen. Now look, ladies and gentlemen. I try to get along with everybody, but sometimes things don't work out. <laughs> <laughs>